Hi there, and welcome. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use ShapeSpark's Switch Object Extension. Take a look at the final result. You can easily switch between several lamps above the table. Now, let me show you how to set this up. First, head over to the Interactivity tab. Click the plus button and select the Switch Object Extension. You can give it a name to keep things organized. Now, select the objects in the scene that you want to toggle between. The next step is setting up the trigger. You can use a default trigger or customize it with your own texture. To place the trigger, simply click on the spot you want it in your scene. You can also adjust its position and size directly in the editor. The final step is to go to the Object tab and enable Isolate Shadows for all the objects used in the extension. This prevents the objects from casting shadows on each other. Once that's done, you can bake your scene. That's it. Finished. Good luck exploring ShapeSpark.